Hi everyone, my name is Julie Sebi. I write the Analytics Corner blog that focuses on data engineering, analytics, and visualization with Alteryx and Spotfire. I'm located in beautiful Whitefish, Montana, and you can find my site at the URL shown on the screen. If you find today's content useful, please hit that subscribe button or copy and paste the link and share it on LinkedIn or other social media. Now, when I built my first app a few weeks ago, I created multiple tabs in the user interface. And you would think that renaming tabs would be easy, and it wasn't easy the first time I did it. Even the Alteryx support person I was working with couldn't remember how to rename tabs. Now, let me show you what I'm referring to in case this isn't clear. This is my workflow, and it is an analytic app. And so if I click on the wizard button to run it as an app, you'll see that I have questions and place and inputs for the users to make selections and enter date ranges. And so when I'm talking about renaming tabs, I'm specifically talking about renaming what's shown here, the word date ranges and questions. Now you create tabs in the interface designer. And if I were to add a new tab, you would see that it pops up with a generic name. And obviously we're not gonna leave this generic name in here. We would want to name it something meaningful. If I right click on it, nothing happens. And if you go through the other menus within the interface designer, you're, you're not gonna find anything in here and there's no way to rename it from any of these menus. I found a community post that said you need to use the configuration pane in order to rename your tabs. And of course, the screenshot that was shown was from a much older version of Alteryx, so it was a little bit hard to follow, but I know that the configuration pane exists in the view menu, and the configuration pane is how you configure all of your tools. You just click on a tool and the configuration pane kind of pops up. And so and that's why I was a little bit confused as to how to use the configuration pane in order to rename the tabs. But here's, here's what happens. So first off, just note that I have both the interface designer and the configuration pane checked in the view menu. So that, that means they're gonna be, that means they'll be visible. My interface designer is currently set to auto hide. So it's gonna show and hide depending on whether or not I'm actually in it. And my configuration pane, which I can bring up by just clicking on any tool, you'll see is set to dockable, which means it's docked and always going to stay there. The way that we rename our tabs is by coming into the layout view of your interface designer, you click on the tab, and then you'll need to click on the configuration pane, which is right behind your interface designer. So now here I could rename this tab and I could call it more questions. And then if I go back to the interface designer, it will update. I don't know what else I, I think I, yeah, there we go. I have to click out of it. Now, if I go back in, it's called more questions. Now this might be hard to, to see if you have different settings such as hide or dockable, or if perhaps your interface designer pane is overlapping the configuration pane, then it could be really hard to get to. Um, because my configuration pane is docked, I don't actually see it as an option right here, and now this is overlapping and there's no way for me to really get to it. So I recommend making this just a little bit smaller so you can click on your tab and then click on the configuration pane. And so that is the right order of clicks and settings in order to easily get into the tab configuration pane to rename tabs. Thank you very much for watching this video. Please subscribe and share to spread the knowledge. Thank you.